Here we are in the gymnasium of Nanjing Sports Institute, one of the oldest venues of youth Olympic games in Nanjing. It used to be a basketball court, but now it is for badminton. And besides the normal seats, there are plenty of temporary flexible seats for a larger audience. Good evening from Nanjing Sport Institute. I'm Ivan Buyanov, part of the IOC Young Reporter Program. Sport fans in China get pretty emotional when it comes to a game between a China and a Japan athlete, especially when it's held in Nanjing, a place where one of China's darkest pages in history was written back in 1937. Half day, I'm Jarek Sablan from the IOC Young Reporters Program. It's been a crazy night here in Nanjing Sports Institute Gymnasium. The women's final just ended and China's He Bin Zhao just won the gold medal against Japan's Akani Yamaguchi. It's been, it was a crazy, crazy game. They kept going, tying back and forth and the crowd was going crazy. The Chinese fans were saying, Jai Yao, He Bin Zhao, come on, He Bin Zhao. And the small Japan, Japanese delegation was saying Nippon, Nippon, which means Japan in Japanese. It's been crazy. The energy in here is so, so much. There's so much energy in here. I'm still feeling so much excitement from the Chinese crowd. Um, Ch when China won the game, it was the crowd was so loud. It was. It's crazy to be here. Um, congratulations to China's He Bin Zhao for the gold medal and also to Akani Yamaguchi for playing her best. She did her best. They tied a lot to, in tonight's game, but ultimately I think the Chinese crowd and their cheers got the best of Akani and she lost, but good job to both of them. I played hard in one first round. Other Japanese athletes were cheering for me. I'm really glad. Was the game more special for you because you had a Chinese opponent and the place that the games are hosted is Nanjing? I respect my rival and played hard, 100% in Dava. In the first round, I felt a little bit nervous when the audience cheered for me. But later, when I was really tired, I got energy from them. Greeting from Nanjing Sport Institute. The final has finished just two minutes ago and you can still feel the mild atmosphere here and the audience in the standings is still in a climax. Things always go like that when China competes with Japan. Now let's uh, interview some of the fans here. The match was fierce at first. China lost the first round but won at last. Chinese girl won at last with weak advantage. We feel very happy for her.